Hi, my name is Danish and this will be a tutorial on increasing the range of the DJI Spark. Trick 1. Use an OTG cable. Trick 2. Switch your drone from CE to FCC mode to get the maximum range. If looking at the specs of the Spark, we will see that Spark uses Wi-Fi and can run on both two frequencies. 2.4 and 5.8 GHz. In each frequency, DJI is divided into two standard FCC and CE. For 2.4 GHz, if FCC 2 km range, if CE 500 meters, and for 5.8 GHz, if FCC 2 km range, if CE 300 meters. Talking about FCC and CE, FCC is the American standard allows longer range and CE is for Europe makes this part completely useless so if you're living in a country that is not America or Europe we have our own standards but DJI will not go through all the trouble and make a bunch of different standards for all the countries in the world so logically what they do is apply the shorter standard on you obviously to protect themselves from the country's laws of course so living in Pakistan my drone obviously thinks it's not in America so it's running on CE but for me to use its maximum potential and get the maximum range out of it I had to trick the drone to think that it is in America to run on FCC mode so to trick the drone there is an app you can find on the Play Store so to download the app go to the play store search for the app floater what this app does is it spoofs your location it gives your gps a fake location and makes the phone think that you are somewhere else now that you have installed floater go to the dji app In the app's Wi-Fi settings, you will see that you have a 13 channel in your channel in your Wi-Fi channels. So this means that your drone is on CE. For your drone to be on FCC, close the app, open Floater. Set your location anywhere in America. For me, I will be selecting Ottawa. Press the play button. Your fake location has been set. Wait for it to reconnect. Okay, go fly. Back in the app. Going to the Wi-Fi settings of your drone, as you can see there are 11 channels instead of 13 channels, which means this drone is running on FCC regulations as for America. This gives you more range on your drone and more power for your Wi-Fi signals. Turn off floater. Now when you restart your drone, your location will be switched to the original location where you really are. So it will ask you again that your location has been changed. For this message, now you just press cancel and ignore the message. Your drone will stay connected on FCC mode with extended range.